So tonight at eight, it's Thursday, and this could become a regular thing, and quite rightly too, as we show our support for the carers in the NHS and other services as well. Eight o'clock tonight, we encourage you to open your front door, open your windows, and give the NHS and all the carers a clap. And East Riding of Yorkshire councillor, ward councillor, Dave Tucker, you'd agree with that, wouldn't you, Dave? Absolutely, John. I mean... You know, we, we, last week was a great response. Um, tonight, the, the communities are absolutely buzzing. You know, I've heard stories of people getting bells and pans. You know, they're going to be out in force in all the communities, towns and villages in South East Oldham tonight to show their appreciation at 8 o'clock for all those frontline key workers, all the people who are keeping the country going, looking after the patients in the hospital. And, you know, it's our way of saying thank you very much, guys. We really appreciate it. Now, Dave, you worked in the NHS for a number of years, didn't you? You've still got friendships and you still are, you know, you've got got your finger on the pulse, literally. Uh, Some of the people you know working in the NHS uh, today. Um, Do they really uh, take any notice of this kind of thing? Is it really important that we do it? Absolutely. Now, it's really interesting you said that, John, because only about an hour ago, I received a call from an ex-colleague's mum who lived in Canaan who said, you know, her daughter's still in the front line in critical care. She's working in the COVID unit. And she said, what a difference it makes. You know, it brings a tear to their eye, you know, because they're having a difficult job anyway, you know, and working long hours, they're covered in suits, they're hot, they're clammy. And said, and just to know that people actually do care about them as well makes a massive difference. Do you know, I mean, you mentioned the suits and the fact they get very warm and hot. I, I actually wore... Uh, you know those um, gloves, the the gloves that you put on your hands uh, with the powder inside the fingers and the and the, and the palms and everything. Mm. And after about half an hour, your hands get even sweaty. I didn't realize I'd never worn those gloves before. I didn't realize how uncomfortable they get. So the, the, just from a, literally wearing that kind of PPE equipment that they're having to do now, um, I mean, it, it's an extra burden, isn't it? In in actual getting helping to get people um, back to good health. Absolutely. And, you know, I mean, tonight is about celebrating all key workers, not just the frontline NHS staff, but you're quite right. I mean, if you're doing a 13 hour shift and you've got a hat suit on, you've got the respirator on, you know, you can't take a drink because you've got a respirator on. You can go four or five hours if the patient's critically ill, even longer, without getting any fluid. You're perspiring, you're losing fluid and it's absolutely draining, you know, and I wouldn't want that on anybody. But these guys are absolute heroes. They're there putting their lives on the line. You know, we've heard all the stories of doctors passing away, sadly, and nurses. And they're putting their lives on the line to make sure that, you know, we can survive and get through this horrible episode. But as I said, it's not just about those frontline workers. Now. It's about all the key workers, the care staff, you know, the guys down in the checkouts, the delivery man, the people who are supporting us all. We just want to say thanks, guys. Absolutely. And Councillor Dave Tucker, stay safe and we will talk again very soon. Thanks ever so much, John. Hope you'll be clapping tonight.